Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I did it. All right. Um, how you guys doing? Uh, I'm here uh, doing another video uh, in regards to my ancestry. Uh, many months ago, I stumbled across um, a website called uh, DNA Land, and they spell it as DNA dot land. That's like the only way you'll be able to get to it. But anyway. Um, and it sparked my interest because it was free and it was uh, offering um, to, you know, tell tell you your um, genetic makeup. And I thought, hmm, I'll do it. So uh, what I did is I, I d uploaded um, some of my raw DNA that I got from 23andMe to the site. And, um, you know, after I did it, it didn't really tell me much. I mean, I had to wait about a day or so or a couple, a couple hours. But uh, anyway, I looked at it and it was like... I could have told myself that, you know what I mean? It didn't really tell me any details, and I was a bit disappointed, felt a little duped. So anyway, I kind of forgot about it for a while, and then I went back to it, and it said the same thing like a month later. I'm like, oh, well, they're not saying much, you know? But uh, anyway, within a week ago, I logged in, you know, randomly, and um, I noticed that they updated the tests, and I'm like, whoa, and it actually gave me a lot more detail you know, and uh, I, I, here's here here are the details. With further ado, here <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and uh, talk about it. But well, what the test said, um, it broke me down to my uh, different regions, and I'm a total of four different regions. I'm strongly African, yeah, man. I'm 83% um, African, it says, and then it says I'm 14% uh, West Eurasian, and I guess that you, you know that's Europe and uh, Middle East. And um, it says I'm 1.6% uh, Native American. I got that little Indian in me. And uh, it says I'm 1.1% East Asian. Hmm, there you go. So uh, going into more detail with uh, the African percentage, which I'm 83%, 73% um, of that is uh, West African. And it actually shows that 10% is actually East African. Hmm, there you go. Um, so in East Africa, I guess, could be, you know, what it shows here is, um, you know, uh, Kenya and Tanzania. That's, uh, I guess, where they got the reference points from. And uh, of the West African, the 73%, 56% um, of uh, my DNA comes from the lower Niger uh, Valley. And um, that's where Nigeria is at, because Niger is the river, and it, uh, the mouth of the river is in Nigeria, so I'm at the lower part. And 56% of my heritage, man, it's like, that's home. That's my homeland, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, that's really cool. Um, and then it also shows, too, that I'm 8.6% um, Mende. And uh, the Mende people, um, they're, you know in Sierra Leone. So I matched some of the reference populations in Sierra, Sierra Leone, 8.6%, and I'm liking that. And also, too, it shows that um, I have 8.3% uh, heritage from the Senegal River Valley. And you know that's in Senegal, okay? <laughs> no questions asked for that one. So yeah, I'm liking all that African. Um, then of my 14% uh, West Eurasian, it shows me being 5.7% Southwestern European. And of that percentage group, it breaks it down even further to 4.1% Southwestern European, which, you know, I know it sounds redundant, but I guess that area in particular is uh, France and Spain. So I'm, I'm liking that part. There you go. I always, I like the Spanish culture anyway. Um, and then uh, it shows me being a uh, Sardinian, about 1.6% Sardinian. And that's um, an island um, off the coast of um, Italy. Um, I initially thought it was uh, the meatball at the bottom because it was like the boot and, the, and the, it's kicking the meatball. But it's not the meatball. It's, uh, it's just an island up <laughs> a little more north. Um, moving on. Um, it shows me being about 3.9% uh, uh, North and Central European. And um, I guess that would be like Ireland, um, Norway, um, you know, those areas, uh, Brit British. Um, 
you know, I, I looked at the reference map, and the reference map had a check mark in Iceland. So I guess some of my DNA matched somebody else's DNA in Iceland. And I'm like, crazy, what? Got some Iceland? You know, crazy. It's probably so small. It's probably like 0.8%. No big deal. But that's really interesting. Iceland, really? You keep crazy. That's that's cray cray. Um, and then it shows that I'm 2.7% um, Balkan. And the Balkan area is, uh, let's see. The Balkan area is where Albania and Bulgaria are at, as well as Greece. So I got um, some of that heritage too. Um, and then the rest, there's about 2% um, ambiguous West Eurasian. And since uh, the test picked up pretty much every other area, you know, I'm just assuming that that 2% is uh, perhaps Middle Eastern, you know, um, so because that West Eurasia covers the Middle East as well. Um, and then I'm 1.6% Native American. There you go. Got a little Indian in me. What? <laughs> and then um, it also shows that uh, I'm 1.1% um, ambiguous East Asian. So that can be anything. But um, as a rule of thumb, um, when I see any Asian show up, because Native Americans and uh, East Asians are very closely re related um, genetically, um, I just I can just lump them together. So those two percentages are almost 3% Native American. There you go. <laughs> so anyway, just about 3%, y'all. You know, it's got a little Indian in me. But anyway, uh, so yeah, that's those are my results from this website. Um, it's interesting. It's all for entertainment value. I mean, this can't really tell me who I am. I know who I am and, and how I grew up. I'm a black man. And I'm in America, and I love it, and there's nothing wrong with that. But um, this, these tests, in general, give me insight to um, where my ancestry comes from, because I, I never really knew. And, um, you know, this has given me more insight than some other tests I did. I mean, 56% of my uh, DNA comes from the um, lower Niger Valley, where Nigeria is at, and so if I were to go up somewhere in Africa, I'm, I, that that should be my first stop, Nigeria, because that's a lot. I might see people that look like me. You know, I might be looking at somebody, and they'd be looking at me, and look at them, and we'd be just looking at each other, and we just don't even know what we're going to do. I'm just kidding. <laughs> if that happened, I'd be like, oh, gosh. You know, but uh, <laughs> anyway, um, so yeah, those are my results. I'm 83% African. 14% uh, West Year Asian, 1.6% uh, Native American, and 1.1% uh, uh, East Asian. I am all over the place, all over the place, with a whole lot of African, baby. There you go. Boom. <laughs> Thank you for uh, taking the time to watch my video. Um, do check out my other videos, too, and um, I also like to do music as well. Um, I uploaded uh, some you know, music, um, to the, to my channel. So do check them out. I just, I call it the sound of my ancestry, you know, cause it is, it comes from inside of me. So everything that makes me will show up in, uh, I guess my art that I do. Uh, so yeah, thank you very much. Uh, and, uh, I hope you're enjoying, uh, your day, night, evening, I don't know. And, uh, like I say, stay tuned for the next episode. Thank you very much. Yeah. Ha, 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 ha.